I'm bearish on cassava sciences, but I am positioned long. Let me explain. I'm bearish because I assign a high probability of them failing phase three. And this is just my opinion based on the information available. To expand on this, I've always maintained the position that from my perspective, I gave them less than 50% chance of passing phase three, even before the recent news of the DOJ investigations. And this is based on a number of reasons, like the small sample size of phase two, the filtering of patients being less stringent in phase two versus phase three, and how tough a vein nut Alzheimer's has been to crack historically. But given the recent events, we need to add on the additional risk of the DOJ investigations into Dr. Wang and two senior cassava officials. As well as the increased scrutiny this will have on other agencies investigating cassava, such as the SEC, and most importantly, the FDA. All of this for me further reduces the chances of phase three approval because it's opened the floodgates to the possibility of the phase three trials being ended early. In summary, I'm bearish on cassava because from my view, there's a high chance, much higher than 50%, that the drug either will not reach the end or fail to meet the statistical significance at the end. Now, despite all that, I am positioned long via shares and call options. Yeah, you heard that right. Am I regarded buying a company that I think will most likely fail? Probably, but let me explain. It all has to do with the magnitude of the change, or convexity, as Nassim Taleb calls it. In this case, the magnitude of the move Cassava will have on the small chance of approval will be a black swan event. And I don't use that word lightly. Therefore, I want exposure to that. Maybe unsurprisingly, I love poker from both a math and psychological perspective. Going long Sava at this point is like calling preflop with a statistically shitty hand. On the one hand, you're not likely to win, but if you hit the nuts, your opponents will definitely not expect it. And so it's a great setup for potentially exponential returns.